Hi, today you are going to learn this about the constant JavaScript property. The constant is actually it is a fixed value that don't change during the execution time. And to declare a constant in your JavaScript using the constant keyword. And for example, you can check out on the below there. So there's constant my birthday and my birthday is 3rd August. So it means when your birthday is dead, you know that and your birthday is dead, it need to be the correct. So if you provide any wrong value, then it will be the execution will be error. So for example, like you are going to explain some of MCQ examination or anything else. So for the MCQ, you can whenever you correct clicking that the correct answer. So this means the constant is the correct value have this on this programming of the MCQ. So this it means correcting that whenever you clicking on the MCQ of the right. So it is showing you the click and for the green click. So it means it is correct. So whenever you're clicking the wrong answer, so it is showing you that the cross icon. So it means the red icon. So it means it's the wrong answer. So I will do you the, the practical about this about the constant that which is the fixed value and which is means the fixed value if you want to change this value and everything so it will be not executed and it will be show an error for this. So let's start and execute it about it. Here you can say I've opened my VS code and there you can say I've added the file that is constant.html. So here I'm using that HTML file and I will be used that is a script in the internal boxes. But if you want to connect that JavaScript from the external, then we can link it here on this header section or the body section or anywhere you want. So you can connect them. Also, you will be get this the source code data sent to my web website. There will be get this the connecting data about the script connection. So here this is first of all about it. We are going to making this about this internal script using here. So this is I have added this and there you can see the title is constant JS. So here now we are going to start that about the constant uses. So first of all, up to the body section. You have to take that script tag and then you have to take it the const so constant you must be remember that this constant tag it must be const and this keyword is there so here we are going to selecting that pi and is equal to 3.1416 so this is we know that actually the constant this pi variable this is pi value and this is the correct value so here now we are going to change try to changing about the value from here so here we're going to be writing that pi equal to so it is 3.1 and i'm going to be providing it one three so this is for the example about it so this is you can see i have provided this is the correct value and this is the wrong value so here we are going to checking it that when it is working or not so for this we can check out it using the console so console log and then we write, need to write the pi and then end of this now open this with the live server now select that inspection mode or press the f12 button then you have to go there your console button here so there you must be find the console so now click on to here the console button there you can see that uncut type your assignment assignment to the constant variable at the constant.html so it means the value we have provided it's not correct so it was showing the wrong so now back to our studio and here when we are going to be providing the same value about it so it is 3.1416 so this is the correct value we have provided now just go back to here and you can just reload it simply so there you can see it was still showing so i just need to make it the clear console from here so here we can make it just remove we can just strictly reload this space and there you can see it was still showing the wrong so here we just need to clear the console and here we can writing that console about it so which is our the correct answer for it console.log and it is pi then press enter you can see that this is the correct value and it was showing there 3.1416 so this is the value and this is correctly informed here so it means the value is correctly printed and when we have checking it so it means when you are going to using that constant you need to provide the fixed value which is true forever and if you provide any wrong value here so then it will be not executed so this is the means the constant you have to provide the fixed value it's only work for the fixed value and if you provide the wrong value or if you want to changing that value then it will be not work so like this is mcq question about there so this is the same way that mcq platform the mcq programming that mcq on the google form so there is a work basically the instant using that using that constant so here we have provided them 
the right answer and when we're providing some wrong answer clicking there in the mcq it will be definitely going towards the wrong and whenever we're providing the right answer then it will be executed as a successful so this is actually how the constant is usable for this so i hope you understand every process about the constant if you're having any issue to do this the practically about the constant using so you can ask me on the comment section below and if you enjoyed this video please like on it and share it with your friends and please subscribe and press the bell icon so that you will never miss any tutorial from us